I find every week nerve-wracking. I mean, you're dancing on live TV in front of a lot of people. Did a kiss. Pulled something out of the hat last week and you've done it again tonight. Was there grunt? Ah, uh, yeah! Ten. Ten. Ten! We got three teams. Perfect score. Yay! Basta doble. Excellent. I like the fact it's a bit darker. It has that confrontational thing in it. This is where we're building up that energy, so we're challenging each other. We've got to get aggressive this week, and I'm going to do what it takes. Ah! This is going to get nasty. I think he's just <laughs> going to basically insult me all week to actually get me fired up. Come on, Denia. Oh, come God, on. It's going to be a fun week. Let's get angry. <laughs> got my trusty roller. <laughs> Look out, Damien. If he's going to push my buttons, I'm going to push his back. That's what the routine's about. We're kind of coming at each other, so we're just we're playing that out in rehearsals. Hopefully that will work well for the, for the routine. Don't get too close. <laughs> Tonight, I just don't want to be distracted by anything else. I just want to think 100% about the routine. After last week's perfect performance, the judges are not going to let us off the hook easy this week unless we give a performance that is to die for. Dancing the Paso Doble, Danielle Spencer and her partner, Damien Whitewood. massive night here at Dancing with the Stars and while we're clapping give it up for the gutsy sound of Chong Lim and the Dance with the Stars Orchestra in fine form this evening okay <laughs> did you think that you'd be capable of of a dance like that when you first started no I had no idea someone would be throwing me around the room like that <laughs> a couple of months ago <laughs> uh, fiery passionate Paso did you enjoy enjoy that dance I did I loved it <laughs> What do your kids think of mum going and dancing on the weekend? Do they enjoy it? I think it's all a bit nuts, but they're enjoying yeah. it. Good, good, good. <laughs> oh, I hope they are. Let's see what the judges thought. Hopefully they enjoyed it. Josh. Sorry, I was just making notes. Uh, wow, what a spectacular opening number. Like, mm. creatively, that was fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Um, I loved how it began. Like, you just started spinning around and then it became airborne and then the breath of life came into you and that crucifix slide and, yes, you were sort of living. Um, <laughs> Well, OK, sometimes routines make me jump out of my seat, but tonight, like, I enjoyed it, but I didn't want to jump out of my seat. For some reason, I was nervous watching you. I don't know why I was nervous. There's something missing again. Um, you put grunt into your routines last week, but for me, I was, I was hesitant, a little bit nervous. Unfortunately, it just wasn't... <laughs> it was... <laughs> ready for the... <laughs> OK. I understand that. Yes. Um, <laughs> Helen? I wasn't nervous at all. I think that's exactly the sort of performance you have to bring to this show to win it. I thought it was absolutely sensational. Thank you. Yeah. 
time. Oh, sorry, we, we, we uh, get no, more No, 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 it's OK. <laughs> I don't really need a, to say anything else. It was a very else. finite point, I thought. That's OK, Daniel. <laughs> and you look lovely, Helen Ritchie, may I say. Thank you, Daniel. <laughs> <Sorry. laughs> what am I, chopped liver? No. <laughs> yes. Do you know what? You're the king and queen of this competition. That's, and that just proves it. No, do you know what? You're at such a point that for us to pick um, is kind of superfluous because you came out, you've grown each, each, each episode, which we wanted to see you come out of your skin. You've done that. The only thing, if I had to pick, you lost your footwork a little bit up yep. here, which you know, but would be your feet every now and again because everything else is so precise. You sometimes don't stretch your feet. So when you did that slide through Daniel's legs, uh, um, sorry, Daniel's, Daniel's legs. legs. <laughs> um, you, your I, feet I, I, I didn't notice it, actually. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, that was, was backstage. <laughs> <laughs> um, your feet were flexed, but yeah. you know that's nitpicking. I thought you were fantastic. Yeah. Beautiful. Thank, Thank you. you. Last week, a perfect score of 30. Damien, how are you going? The driving force in this partnership. It's going or? well. Obviously, Danielle's so dedicated to the you know performance each week, mm. but it's getting harder and harder. Like we've got to keep raising yeah. that bar all the time. Yeah. As I'm throwing around even more and more now. He's <laughs> killing me. Oh, it's very <laughs> well worth it. What do you reckon, ladies and gentlemen? Nice. Danielle and Damien are going to find out your scores after the break. Head back to the ballroom bullpen. And if Danielle delivered what you want tonight, then pick up the phone and call 1902 557718. Or SMS Danielle to 191777. You'll also be supporting her charity, which is the Australian Children's Music Foundation. Well, tonight, six will become five. Coming up, we've got Zoe, we've got 